All right. And I think we're live. Uh, hello and welcome to the stream, everybody. This is my first official stream. I'm going to be playing Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening, um, and this is going to be the first part of a series that I do just completing the game. Um, after that, I'm going to move to Untitled Goose Game, maybe play some Minecraft in the future, and whatever game that comes out that looks pretty awesome, which is a lot of Nintendo games, so I'll probably be mostly focusing on those. Um, and right now, it just kind of works with the system I have set up. Right now, it's mostly just uh, console gaming, because um, my streaming setup is definitely not pro because of course i'm just getting started but if things expand i'm hoping to uh expand what i play as well so um here's here's to streaming let's just get started um also a note on sound i would love tips and feedback if anything isn't working right um or if there's any way i can improve this right now i'm actually using ambient speaker sound um, which is not ideal, but it's all I could do to set the stream up today, and I really wanted to just start today and get going, so. All right, here we are. So I've actually never played the original either, and um, the ads for this were amazing, though. I mean, it just floored everybody when it came out. <laughs> I'm really excited for this title, and I'm, I'm so ready to play this. Oh, it looks so good. This is adorable. Like I said, I've never even played the original, so um, I'm actually really excited to be surprised by the story. I know this is a classic that people love, and this looks like a really awesome remake of it, so I'm really excited to do a first playthrough. <laughs> Listen! See, everyone craps on Nintendo graphics, but I think this looks pretty good. <laughs> the music is so cute! <laughs> oh, I'm so ready. <laughs> oh, man. Twice as much damage, no heart drop. Uh, I'm gonna start with normal for now. <sighs> Should I do it? Should I do Lonk? Alright, I'm gonna do the thing. It just, it just makes the game funnier over time. <laughs> I'm sure a million other people are doing long too, but I don't care. It's funny. What a relief. I thought you'd never wake up. You were tossing and turning. What? Zelda? No, my name's Marin. You must still be feeling a little woozy. <laughs> so I knew this wasn't Zelda, but like, I have a feeling she's gonna be revealed to be a version of Zelda, kind of like, you know, Tetra and um, uh, Wind Waker. You're on Koholint Island. Koholint. <laughs> Follow the lane south to reach the beach where I found you. Since you washed ashore, lots of nasty monsters have been in the area, so be careful, okay? I mean, I'll be careful. Can I pick up pods? Oh, uh, this is a stand for something that says piranha plant. I, I really thought that was going to be an amiibo thing. Oof, this looks heavier than heavy. Your current strength won't cut it. You know, can I just start throwing pods? Who's this guy? Looks like Mario. Tarin. <laughs> Well, Lonk, I forgot about that. You finally snapped out of it. Name's Tarin. Tarin? Tarin. 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 Hope you're feeling better. What? How, how did I know your name? You think it's weird, eh? Oh, I saw it on the back of the shield. <gasps> oh. Got your shield back. Hold R to repel enemies with it. Okay, oh, cute. Oh, it's on like a, a grid. That's great. Oh yeah, some of the other stuff like this washed up on the beach. If when you go back, watch out looking for monsters. Ever since you showed up, Blanc, I've seen them all over the place. Hey, what are you doing in my chest? Where'd you learn to do such a thing? I mean... I mean... 
you know I have to like check everything. This kind of reminds me of like an Animal Crossing house a little bit. <laughs> Follow us. Oh, I yeah, I read that already. Yeah, I read that. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna be doing voices for now on the characters, but if you don't like that, just say the word and I will not do them. But I think it's nice to read them out loud for viewers. And if you hear background ambient noise, that would be my cat, Frankie. Uh, she's the best. And also, really annoying, but the best. Oh, yeah. Yep. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can talk to the fox. <laughs> this game is delightful. Wait, oh, what did this say? A fish in the pond. See, it, was <laughs> it wasn't even like... <laughs> reading. Here sleeps the flying rooster. Fox is so cute. Can I activate this? I probably need to activate this. I did play um, a Link Between Worlds on the DS, 3DS, and that was a really good game. So I'm kind of used to like some of this layout, but um, I'm, you know, still getting used to everything. Writing is on the other side. What? Oh, I was reading it from behind. I read that already. Oh. Does that hurt? Can I just push him around? <laughs> also, I love that, like, there's chain chomps in this. I'm pretty sure, like, Again, I don't know the origins, but I'm pretty sure it was like shared assets between um, Mario and Nintendo games and old school uh, Zelda games, but I could be wrong, it's just a hunch. Is this where I came from? Yeah, it's where I came from. Okay. They did tell me to go south, but you know I'm gonna be exploring. But, <laughs> but I just want- I want to cut stuff open. Oh my gosh. It's so cute! Hey man, when you want to save, hit up the system screen. You get there by opening the sub screen with plus then pressing R. Okay. Don't ask me what that means, I'm just a kid. Hmm. <laughs> Fourth wall breaking already. This, you know, this blurring effect is really neat around here. It's kind of adorable. This music is amazing. <laughs> Who am I talking? Old man, Olrira. Bring, bring. Hello, it's Olrira. Ask me anything about the island. If you get lost, give me a call. You know, there's a library in the village that might have some good information for you. Talk to you later. Click. Wait. Can I talk to him again? Oh, oh okay. Just tell me to go to the library. <laughs> it's just, it's just the old man on the line whenever you want. Wait. Okay. Yeah. No, I didn't miss that. <laughs> this game is adorable. Oh. <laughs> Her name's Yahoo. <laughs> I'm clearly just like delighted by everything on this stream. It's very cute. Yahoo, I'm fine, and you? Wait, what? Yahoo, I'm fine, and yeah, that was right. And you? Yahoo! I think I saw that Yahoo did a rebrand with Pentagram. I'm a graphic designer, so I noticed these things, um, but I didn't see the whole thing. It looks all right. It looks like kind of in the same way as, you know, a lot of other rebrands, but, you know, rebrands. Okay, so this house is cute. Oh, this is the same old man. Er, uh, hmm, how to say, please call outside. Seems old man Olrira is a shy guy in person. I think he's also Santa Claus. Just want to, like, interact with everything. Checking. Is this a stand for something? It says blooper. Oh, there's, like, a whole bunch of stands I can, like, bring stuff to. This one says cheap, cheap. Yeah. Oh man, you bet I'm gonna like break everything. Oh, 
This is so adorable. So does this hurt me? No. <laughs> I really thought it would hurt. Oh, this one's cute. I can talk to them! Makeup, jewels, dresses. I want it all. Chow chow. <laughs> it's cute. It's like no accessories would be nice. So I have to just like bring chow chow stuff, I guess. Can you move? Thanks. Oh man. I don't know if you can hear my computer, but this thing is uh, about to take off. Is this a stand for something? It says bow wow. A bow wow. <laughs> Madam Meow Meow. These names! Who wrote these names? Ho oh, ho ho! My name is Bow Wow. Wait, sorry. My Bow Wow is so proud of his fine fur coat. What? Is that Chow Chow? Which one's Bow Wow? Is this Bow Wow? I can't talk, I can't talk to that. I think that's Bow Wow. Should have named it Arf Arf. Okay. What's this one have? A stand for Bawa. Oh, I just read that Bawa. Okay. I'm smart. Lonk. Lonk will never not be funny. <laughs> Everything checks out. Sorry, I just I just have to like <laughs> I'm one of those um oh come on. Thank you. I kind of play video games in a way where I just have to like look through everything. I want to find all the secrets and all of the um, all of the you know things you can collect, unless it becomes excruciatingly boring and then I decide to stop. But so far, this game is absolutely adorable. Can I talk? Oh, I heard you can press minus to look at island map. Not only you can stick pins in it with A to remember stuff, but I don't understand what they mean by that. Okay. Oh. There we are. So this kind of looks like a grid system map, and maybe it's just what I've seen so far, but um, kind of reminds me a little bit of Cadence of Hyrule style maps. Yeah. I hear that when you're running out, oops, wait, what? Yeah. I hear that when you're running out of hearts, you better go find a big fairy. I have no idea, I'm just a kid. I think I want to use that excuse for things I don't know at work. I don't know, I'm just a kid. Oh, Atlas of Koholin Island. You can look up the name of a place. Do you want to look at this map? I do want to look at this map. Whoa. Okay, so we're in Mabe Village. I want to go to the beach. But I wonder if there's anything stopping me from going to Ukuku Prairie, Pothole Field, Martha's Bay. I'm serious, these names are so cute. All right, you know what? I'm gonna get to that eventually. I'll come back if I need to look at the map. Properties of warp points. Um, uh, sure, we'll go through this quickly. There are some warp points on Koholin Island you can warp to, to and fro using these spots. You can only, you can warp only to a point you have stood on with your own two feet, okay? So like, uh, link between worlds. Maps and memories guidebook, yes. You can see an island map by pressing minus, zoom in or out with R. The rough parts of the map are places you have not yet visited. If there's a place you want to remember later, you can press A to mark it with a pen. Press X to look back on your adventure, revisiting memories of things you have learned or conversations you've had. How convenient. Selecting the item that's right for you, sure. The subscreen you can get to with plus is very useful. You can select your favorite items. Oh, these are like quick use items that you use most frequently. Fun with bombs. Yes, I want to read this one. After you put a bomb down, you can pick it up by pressing A again. You can then throw it by pushing A one more time. Did you know that? Now I do. Secrets of the Whirling Blade. I will read it. Whirling Blade is a technique that has been handed down from generation to generation by the family of the hero. I'm assuming that's me, but no spoilers. To use it, hold down B and build up your power. When you have had, when you have enough, you can release it. Can you master this? I can. How to handle your shield like a pro? Yeah. If you hold R, you can defend yourself and you can push enemies too. Besides the standard shield, there's also a mirror shield. Yeah. This 
is a bookshelf. Oh, I could, you could see that, okay. Man. I know this game is really like simple and marketed towards kids, but it's just absolutely delightful. And I am loving it so far. Tail Cave, Toronbo Shores. Should I go to the cave? Can I go down there yet? Ooh. Should I be avoiding them? Okay, I'm just gonna check to see if there's any place I can go without a sword. Mysterious forest moblins ahead. They're not friendly. So it looks like I can't... Yeah, I can't get through here. Can I run? No, it looks like I don't know how to run yet. Which is just kind of like a funny thing to have to learn how to do. No records yet. Give it a try. How about some fishing? Ten rupees. You know, I would. But I'm poor. You have to have more passion. No, I have to have more money. Live a little. <laughs> I mean, some call it passion, some call it money. <laughs> oh, this game's amazing. I'm so excited to be playing this and, like, actually start streaming, because um, this has been on my list, and this was a really good way to start out. This game. Did I talk to him? Well, it seems that after you save, you will start at the last place you saved, unless it's a dungeon where you start at the entrance. I'm not really sure why that is, because I'm a kid. I'm just a kid. Yeah, again, really good excuse for things. I am actually going back to work tomorrow after, like, a week and a half of vacation. And I'm not going to know a lot of stuff, because I have a ton of emails that I need to get through. So I'm just going to reply to all of them saying, I don't know, I'm just a kid. And see where that gets me. Uh. Mamasha. With four boys who look alike, I even get... I even I get confused sometimes. Yeah, that's true. I have cousin triplets and they I like still have a hard time telling who's who apart and I feel so bad because they're like old now. <laughs> and I'm sure they want their individuality. Okay. By the way, my baby wants a Yoshi doll. I saw one at the trendy game, but I couldn't get it. Ma'am, your baby's like can't even understand what a baby doll is. Who's this guy? Nice haircut. <laughs> Papal. Yep, those are my boys. I'm Papa. Pleased to meet ya. I'll be lost in the hills later, <laughs> so keep a lookout for me. Here? Oh, I lost it. Is he planning on getting lost? There's so many beds. There's so many kids. Is this a shelf or is this a spiny? Oh, I gotta collect a lot of things. Shy guy. This one. Pokey. I think I saw a shy guy one before. I think there could be some repeats. Hmm. Just gonna test something out real quick. Bear with me. I just want to make sure my mute. Okay. All right. We should be good. Sorry about the audio cutting out for a second. I just wanted to make sure that we actually had audio because I had test muted before. And if you guys weren't hearing any part of this, that would be pretty bad. Okuku Prairie, farther east, Animal Village. Hmm. Can I buy things here? Oh, let me guess. It's gonna tell me. Oh my, his face! Shopkeeper. What, what is it with Zelda games and having the most terrifying shopkeepers? This is gonna be here. I do, I want the shovel. Uh, sorry kid, you don't have the rupees. Come back when you have cash. I think you mean passion. Because in this game, passion and cash are interchangeable. Um, did I talk to the kid? I did. I did talk to him. It's a claw game here. I can't get to. Okay, all right. I think it's time to go to the beach because I'm. No, sorry. I did not mean to do that. I was looking at a different screen. But I do love that phone music. No, I want to go to the beach and see what I can do with this chicken there. Because I want my sword and I want to start throwing pots and destroying grass and all sorts of fun things. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh. Yep. Okay. I thought I was supposed to be able to reflect with those. 
Maybe not. Okay, whatever. Do we have to do it like last second? No. I'm not sure if it was a timing thing. I think I just need a sword. Can I? <laughs> I, should, I sh Okay, I should have called that one. But I'm gonna blame it on the fact that I never played the original game. Ouch. So far, I'm really good at this. <laughs> um, these are adorable. I need a tail, a keyhole. It says tail keyhole. Tail keyhole. Hmm. I know I said it before, but this blurring effect is absolutely adorable. I actually like it because it helps keep the focus on um, the parts of the screen that you're actually on. And it does a nice job of um, adding some some visual interest to the simplistic version of the graphics here. Everything is just so like smooth and cute here. It's a really, I don't know, I think it's really smart of Nintendo to like play with these sorts of uh, graphic styles. Beware of sea urchins, don't touch them with your bay hair and hands. So can I do this? Oh, yeah. Ah, they have taught me. <laughs> Even their eyes are so cute. Okay, oh. Nope. I need this. It's my sword. Oh, it's an owl. <laughs> This is one of those ones where if you button mash too much, it'll go away. I mean, it'll restart the dialogue. Hoot hoot. So you are the lad who owns the sword. Now I understand why the monsters are starting to act so violently. A courageous lad has come to wake the windfish. Is that me? They said that you cannot leave the island unless you wake the windfish. You should now go north to the mysterious forest. I will wait for you there. I mean, okay. Windfish. Ah, oh, I have a sword. You found your sword. It must be yours because it has your name engraved on it. Could you imagine getting a sword and it's it has the name Lonk on it? Okay. Oh, so exciting. Link's sound effects are just the cutest. Okay. I'm definitely gonna have to come by and bomb this. Cute! And the enemies are cute. Is this monkey good? Oh. Ouch, not good. Not great. Oh, that beeping is gonna be not fun. Hi, Sail. So maybe we'll just let an alligator sell things. Welcome to the house of bananas. I'm Sale, this is my house. This looks like something out of Donkey Kong. Actually, my hobby is collecting rare and unusual canned foods. My brother is an artist, so I guess strange hobbies run in the family. All right. Oh, I can't break the pots yet. It's okay, I can break the grass. Oh, well they just gave that to me. I'm okay with that. I didn't want to hear the beeping anyway. I have a feeling this is going to be a pretty easy, uh, but fun game. Ouch. I say as I walk into a spike. <laughs> they fly so far when you hit them. anything in the corner. Eh. It's gonna be a really probably puzzle based game. Like you know most Zelda games. How strong do I have to be to lift those things though? Just gonna, you know, smite everything in our path. I 
to go back up to the town and just start destroying grass. I love that everything was composed. It feels like everything was composed on like toy instruments. Oh no. Oops. Bird. I know what this does, and I'm tempted. I'm just gonna leave it alone. I'm destroying grass, destroying grass, destroying grass. Something very satisfying about just like <laughs> cutting all the grass in a game, but not in real life. Oh, oh, money! Oh, yeah. I wonder how hard it is to get money in this game, because I've gotten, ooh, a shell. Found a secret seashell, but what do you do with it? That is a very good question. I am wondering the same thing. Kid, saw you. I'm supposed to go with the mysterious forest, but I'm too busy cutting grass. Oh yes. Did I read this? Oh, okay, well, it looks like I can't go anywhere until I get the sword. I mean, not the sword. Oh, my brain. Um, until I get the gloves or something that makes me stronger? Or maybe I just need to bench more, I don't know. Yep, yep. Oops. <laughs> I don't know what I expected. <laughs> I don't know why that scared me at all. <laughs> I'm sorry, Fox. That was very mean. I deserve that. <laughs> Gosh, she's so cute. Oh, she's out here. Okay. Should I go talk to the dude? Yeah, let's talk to, oh, Mario. Where'd Mario go? I know his name's not Mario, but he looks like Mario. And I forgot his real name, so he's Mario now. Ugh. Hi, not Zelda. Hi, Tar Tarin. Hi, Tarin. Oh, hi. Tarin went to the forest to look for toadstools, but I'd rather sing. Okay. Listen to this. It's called The Ballad of the Windfish. Aww. It is kind of weird to, you know, just sing to a stranger. But that's cool. Oh, okay. I thought I might have to memorize that. I don't think so. Did I go in here? Also, look how, like, his face gets red when you try and, like, lift a thing. That's cute. Also, like, push a thing. I was here. Okay. Alright, I could cut grass all day. Let's make some progress. I'm sorry to all foxes for my violence. I should have known better. Can I fish now? Do I have enough money now? No, I don't want to spend the money now. So this time it really is passion and not money. But I don't want to spend all my money fishing right away. Unless... I need... Actually, you know what? I might need to spend money in the shop. Where is it? I wish I could run. Is there a way to run? I've asked this before, but I feel like I'm missing something. Uh, it's slow going for walking. It's alright. Is this a shop? It's not a shop, it's a library. That's cool. So, where's the 
shop. Wait. Oh my gosh, that just almost hit me. What? Why am I? Okay, I need to I need to look at a map. Oh, I see. It's up in the. Wow. I think I walked right past it. Items. Okay, so I can't. Oh, cute. I'm gonna just save it. Lonk. Yes. Those are some very sparkly sound effects. Subscreen. Okay, so there is no running move that I know of. That's cool. Yet, so far. I'll just be slow for a little bit. So do I just like spam grass cutting until I get enough money to buy stuff? Sounds about right. So I have the shield. Three hearts, shovel. I feel like I'm gonna need a shovel. Oh, piece of heart. Okay, I'm not gonna be able to get enough money in time. That's okay. All right. Now let's go to the, okay, let's go to the um, forest. Go and get some stuff. More stuff. Maybe we can learn how to run there. Nope. Don't worry, I'll learn the map eventually. <laughs> Ooh. Spooky. Just in time for spooky season. Hoot, brave lad, on your quest to wake the dreamer, welcome to the mysterious forest. Much of mystery you will find on this uncharted Koholint island. I'm afraid you may find it a little... Ugh, let me start. I'm afraid you may find it a trifle difficult to leave the island while the fish, the wind fish naps. By the by, have you ever visited the tail cave which is south of the village? Go there with the key you find in this forest. The wind fish is watching. Alright. So this game really, like, holds your hand. I'm cool with that. This is a nice, easy... Oh. Nook! Hello, raccoon. As a raccoon, my nose is very sensitive to stuff like dust and powder. <laughs> Belly making that noise. Oh. I've got plenty of pep. Come see me when you feel like you can't go on. Oh. She restores you. They're so cute. Nothing like the fairies in Ocarina of Time. Hmm. I have zero idea where I am. And now I kind of know where I am. Okay. That's what a map's for. with cracks. Don't get too comfortable on them. I read that like a poem. Could be a poem. Oh, this one is a sword. Oh, strategy. Right. I think... 
I can't move them yet. I need to be strong. Again, Mom just needs to lift some more. <gasps> oh. You know what? I need to go back here and I need to find the key. And all the grass just respawned. That's cool. Okay, can't go that way. I'm pretty sure that would be the key. Just have to find a way around this area. Just gonna sneak on by ya. Just gonna sneak right past you here. That was pretty violent for a cute little kid's game. Ooh, piece of power. <gasps> I want to find something to kill with my power. But where? It's going to wear off before I find anybody. Um, how long does this last? Ooh. All right, let's just go here. chest? Alright. I'm good at this puzzle thing. I think... Hmm. Guess I can't move these yet. I can. Alright, I'm going back. That's something I should have tried. Hmm. Oh, I see. I mean, let's be real. <laughs> there wouldn't be a puzzle that hard yet. Nice. So we can push rocks, but it can't lift grass. That makes sense. Let's think about this. I might regret that. No. Oh, it's a big, heavy skull. See if I can come back to this way. Can I come back? Oh, good. Okay. Good. All right, how do I do this? Hmm. I mean, I could come back when I lift those things. But is there a way to get that now? Hmm. I don't know if there is. Oh, I can't move it anymore. I think I messed that. I'm for yeah, I messed that up. Alright, so I need to be able to lift. I think it might be set up so that it's not possible. But if it is possible and I just didn't realize it, oh well. <gasps> Mushrooms. I should get that for Mario. You can pick the toadstool. As you hold it over your head, a mellow aroma flows into your nostrils. Why didn't they just say nose? Alright. Hmm. Okay, so I got the mushroom. Hmm. 
so I can. Good job. Good job, me. Yeah, I can make it through here. But I don't think I can get that heart, so I'll just get it back. Get out of here. take that but I want to go into the forest instead of away from it so maybe I go find Yuki I don't think I went this way yeah this feels right there yet. Clearly I need to go this way. So maybe I need to go this way to get the gloves. Eh, makes sense. Leave the forest, go back into the forest. Ooh. Ooh, okay, not good. Mmm, that looks scary too. I'll just do it. YOLO! Oh. <laughs> Not scary at all. <laughs> oh, she's cute, the witch. Ah, it has the sleepy toadstool it does. We'll mix it up with something in a jiffy. We will. Wait. I don't remember giving her- did I just give her my toadstool? That's all ready it is, take care, as there's not much there. Why not try it a bit in my hut? You got some magic powder. Open the substance and use it to slow it. Did it? Did she? She just took my toadstool. Okay. But like, what if I wanted that for? To, what if I wanted to give that to Mario? Okay. That's cool. Just take my stuff. I can't handle this guy yet. Crazy Tracy and Manbo's Pond. Man, I really wanna... Where's my strength? Alright. And this game really just hands out the hearts, huh? doesn't make me powerful enough to lift those things. <sighs> this feels like the right way. So... I like that this feels like it makes me more fast. But for real though, like, once I go through here, like, <laughs> where do I go? Yeah. 
Ooh. That's intense. So just like... Like, I can't cross those ways. Hmm. I need to go find the Tom Nook again. sound effects. Whoops. Nice. Got the bats. Oh, get off of me. Off, 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 off. Stuff. Am I missing something in the ground here? Like, do I get anything from you? No. Definitely should be this hard. Okay, I probably shouldn't be falling down holes either. Talk to him again. Powder and dust. Hmm. Does he like move me when he does that? Powder and dust. Wait, is this powder? I'm an idiot. Can uh use some magic? Okay. To be honest, I'm not sure exactly what this powder does. It looks like it just destroys things. So maybe we try this. Nope, I just wasted some powder. We have to find I'm pretty sure this will come in handy. Powder on this raccoon. Yeah, I think I gotta. All right, backtracking again. So you have to put up with all this. Oh well. Oops. 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 Okay. I'm a little impatient. Just gonna go throw some magic powder on this raccoon. Alright, let's go find this raccoon. He puts you like somewhere else in the woods. I guess I want that. You know what? This is a good way to make money. I'm cool with this. Oh, it's just here. Raccoons this way. I don't think this dungeon is supposed to be that hard. It's not even a dungeon, it's like a dungeon tutorial. Yeah. 
Oh, oh, there we go. What is happening? <laughs> oh, it's Mario. Oh, that has to be Charles Mar Martinelli? Martinetti? Charles Martinet. Martinelli. <laughs> that has to be that has to be the voice of Mario. Last thing I re the last thing I can remember was biting into a juicy a big juicy toadstool. Then I had the darndest dream well, I was a raccoon. No, you were a raccoon. Sounds strange, but it sure was fun. Uh, ah, okay. I can keep it. Wow. Oh, it's the key. It's got like googly eyes on it. Oh, now the owl's gonna tell me where to go. Take the key and go to Tail Cave. Retrieve the instrument that is hidden there. Go now. The windfish is waiting. Hoot. Okay. All right. Ooh, Speedy Boy. Gopanga Swamp Mysterious Forest. Foam. Cool. Gopanga Swamp. Danger. Keep out except Bow Wow. Hmm. I'm gonna need to get the Chain Chomp here. Warp. Can I warp home? No. I think it wants me to walk. But I'm pretty sure I will be able to wa uh, warp. Bye, Mario. No more tripping. Uh, I feel kind of bad getting in from behind like this. So eventually, I would love to get the strong arm tool or whatever, or just like lift some more weights or something. I want to be able to move those rocks. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hearts, give them to me. Hi, Fox. I'm sorry. Did you forgive me for hurting you or your brethren? How much money do I have? Oh, I'm getting close to 200. I could buy that piece of heart. I wonder if I could take that chain chomp with me, too. Can I get these apples? Yeah. Hmm. It's kind of hard to kill, like, the simple enemies that don't have weapons. Like, I know they hurt you, but they're kind of cute. Okay. <laughs> These monuments are the cutest things. Sweet. <gasps> it's so bassy. I love it. Alright. Hmm. These things are a little creepy. Nightmare? What's what's a nightmare? Okay. Oh. Probably should have done that to begin with. You got a small key, it can open a locked door. Nice. No, before I go too far in this, I think I'm actually gonna stop here or somewhere close that makes sense because I don't want to get too far and have to like lose all my progress. 
Oh yeah. All right, I'm gonna get that and then I'm gonna head out. But I think I need to end for the night because I have to go to work tomorrow. And it's the first day I'll be back since vacation and I do not wanna go super tired, but don't worry, I will be back and I will be streaming this again. Uh, I'm hoping to make this a more regular schedule, except I can't stream tomorrow because I have band practice, but don't worry. I will be streaming again on Thursday, probably similar time, either 8 or 9 o'clock, whatever I can. And I'm hoping I can make this a more consistent uh, streaming schedule in the future, but come join me again. It's been fun. Um, I am OKBs, otherwise known as Amy. Um, please follow me um, or just give me a, a like. I don't know. Help me out. Uh, tell your friends I'll be playing more of this and I hope to see more of you here too. Alright, it's been fun guys. I will see you next time.